Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, we will talk about virtualization software. The virtualization software are those who help us to run guest OS, for example, Ubuntu or even Windows inside host OS without reconfiguring hardware or doing native installation. In this video, we will talk about how we can download and install VMware which is one of very famous virtualization software. So without further ado, let's dive in. Okay, so let me open browser and here we simply need to type VMware download. And actually VMware comes in two variant. One is a VMware Workstation Player and another one is paid version, which is Workstation Pro. But in our use case scenario, when we simply need to run any OS or any guest OS, then player is good enough. So we will be going with a VMware player. So let's go here in product. And then from here, we need to look for a workstation player. Let's click on it. And from here, let's go down. And here it seems like VMware company is now being bought by another company named as Broadcom. And due to that, you may not able to download any software as of today, because here we can see the message which says that as part of the transition to Broadcom system, the store will be moving to new domain. And not to worry guys, I'm going to show you how still you can download VMware player from third party. For that, let's open one of very popular free software download website, which is known as file hippo. Now here we need to type VMware player. Now here we need to click on this link which says a VMware player. And then let's click on download latest version for Windows. And now you will see that the download will begin. So let's wait for a while for the download process to get completed. Now let's click on open run the setup and now we will see the installation has begun now let's click on next and I'm gonna actually minimize everything here and now um, actually I already have installed that's why I'm getting this option but uh, let me click here on change and then uh, we simply need to click on next then click on next in this way guys we will able to install vmware workstation player in our system let's wait for a while till the whole process get completed and there we go now let's click on finish and now it will ask us to restart our system if required then um it's up to you actually you can restart your system or you can even keep on working without restarting by clicking on no now let's me type here vmware workstation player and there we go guys here i can see we have successfully installed a vmware workstation pro in a windows 11 device in case of machintos we have created a separate video of how we can install vmware fusion in mac os as again it comes for free and also support apple silicon and that too for free so you do not need to pay for parallel if you want to see that installation then please check out that video that i have added in the description of this one i hope guys you find this video helpful and informational if so then please do like and subscribe to technoholic to see more such content and i will get you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye